I just saw the thumbnail for this video. Oh my God, if that's who I think it is. Anyways, we have the Sumeru preview teaser number three, Prelude to Wisdom. So I think this might be the final one. We'll see. Let's just check it out, man. Let's just get right into it. That thumbnail, man. Who was that? Got more views on Sumeru. Like, what are they gonna show in this trailer? That that was like, bro, what's that? Gotta be who I think it is. Shumi is a country of wisdom. The country's many things are being dealt with by the Jiaoling Court. As the Dao Qi film shows, the Bachong Gods are providing the information. Oh yeah. Wisdom in Shumi is used as a resource to be managed. And the means to achieve this is the power of the Lord of the Heart. 由前代草神大慈树王所留下的遗产，名为虚空的系统。还有一个很有趣的点是，在须弥，大部分的人们，尤其是成年人，似乎都是不会做梦的。They can't dream。所以也有了“须弥人不会做梦”这样的说法，而当地人也会认为这是一种理性与智慧的象征，而非常自豪。须弥森林恰到好处的湿度和土壤。非常适合训练的繁衍。That's that's kind of messed up. 为了增加繁衍和保护菌群的能力，驯类发生了进化，形成了一个全新的物种——驯兽。They had the thing on their ears. 更是进化出了很强的动物性，具有领地意识和不弱的攻击性。丛林中也栖息着各种各样的动物，其中也有不少神奇的生物。Oh my god, the animals! 还会遇见一个新的势力——镀金女团。他们是来自沙漠谷的移民，不加入任何国家势力，而是以自己的智慧和力量讨生活，也就是雇佣兵。在丛林之外的荒漠沙漠中，同样掩埋着许多过去的伤痕和遗产，有守卫着那些被黄沙淹没的古代秘密的超文明机器，也有受到这些事物影响而异化的凶猛野兽。镀金女团也掌握了一部分古代文明的遗产。作为应对危机时最后的威慑手段，具体是什么？ Genshin messed up as always. Messed up past. 主角在须弥的旅行同样会邂逅各种各样的伙伴。作为智慧之国，学者们的角色当然是必不可少的。比如，作为生论派的学者， Tainari, 如今正在担任巡灵官的提纳里， Watcher, 在奥摩斯港邂逅。出身教灵院支论派的艾尔斯。此外， Academy. 其他各方势力的角色也会与主角产生交集。<笑>比如，作为沙漠子民，隶属镀金旅团的雇佣兵西亚，还有独辟蹊径，在须弥这样的智慧与理性的国度追求艺术和舞蹈的一路。Okay, okay. 而随着旅行的继续，神秘少女纳西达，还有大风机关赛诺的角色也会依次登场。至、no. oh oh、此为止。Bro, okay. I'm sorry. I was talking over him. He was talking at the same time, but I couldn't get my excitement. So I gotta go back. That was. So they showed Tainari, which we know about. We know a little bit about him, not too much. But he said he's a forest watcher. And what did he say before that? He said, for example, uh, oh yeah, okay, amateur researcher, forest watcher. Then he says, a person you meet by the chance in Fort Armos. Al 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 Haytham, Al Haytham is the Arvaria in Kenemia. Dude, he looks kind of like Zhang Li, like a more like fierce Zhang Li. He looks good. He looks good, and everybody has like a little thing on their ear, which is really weird. Says in addition, uh, characters from other walks of life will also cross paths with the traveler, and then it shows Dia or Dia. Dia. He looks good, man. Wow. I hope she's a five-star character. I'd assume all these are five-star characters, but I don't know that for sure. So she's um. Oh, so, so she's a mercenary as well. I wonder if she from the Eremite. I wonder if she is. No, if we're gonna meet her, she won't be part of the enemy. I think that wouldn't make any sense. We also have Nilo or Nilo, who went off the beaten path. Ooh, interesting. In such a land that values rationality and wisdom, such as Sumer. 
Yeah, she looks like she has sort of like a, a Eula thing going on with the dance. Like she's kind of like doing a dance. Possibly. And then I, yeah, I mean, come on, man. Who do you guys think that is? That's gotta be the Archon. I mean, the, the voice and then the look, like Nadia, a mysterious girl. Yeah, a mysterious girl, sure. That's the Archon, hands down. And dude, this is nuts. Oh, dude, like the, watching that Dane Slab trailer just makes you so hype because like we've seen Sino so long ago and there he is. Was that an Electro Vision? Yeah, he's Electro. What? I thought it was going to be like Hydra for some reason. I don't know why, but he's Electro. Interesting. Huh. Yeah, I wonder what banner he's going to be on. But yeah, he looks good, though, in his, his 3D model. This is the first time I get to see that, his 3D model. Yeah, it was Electro. That's interesting. And that's in the net. Yeah, that's what they showed. What a jam-packed trailer, man. I, I, I mean, yeah, once again, I'm sorry for like pausing or talking over him, but it's hard to contain your excitement when you see the, <laughs> the characters and whatnot. But dude, I mean, I got to pull for everybody here, you know, I'm, I, probably besides Tainari, because he's the first one. And, you know, there's going to be so many characters to pull for. But I don't know. I mean, I kind of want to pull for everybody, honestly. But Al Haytham, Dia, um, you know, Sino, of course, and Nilo looks pretty cool, too. I wonder if we can actually see everyone's vision. Let's see. Let's, let's go back. So Tainari is definitely Dendro. Al Haytham, I can't quite tell. I'd assume. I can't tell. I assume he'd be Dendro as well, but he kind of looks like he's no, no, he's Dendro. He's Dendro. Far right, he's Dendro. Okay, so he's Dendro. Tainar is Dendro. Al Haytham is Dendro. Dia, I'd assume right off the look is Pyro, wearing all red. But then again, the Kozlo was wearing all red the first time I saw him. Uh, there's, there's no. Oh, there it is. Yep, he's she's Pyro. She's Pyro. We've got Dendro, Dendro, Pyro. And Nilo wearing blue. She is. That's not her vision right here. Uh, can't see it entirely, but I think it's safe to assume she's Hydro because all the blue. I can't actually see it full on, but I'm assuming she's Hydro. And then of course the Dendro Archon has to be done. Let me know Sino is like. All right, so we have. Denjo Tainari, Denjo Al Haytham, Pyro Dia. Once again, I'm assuming they're all five star. Electric Sino, uh, Hydro Nilo, I'm going to assume. And then Denjo Archon. Yeah, that's sick, man. Like I said, once again, uh, let, me know, let me know if you guys are excited or not. Who you're going to be pulling for, who you're going to be saving for. And that'll do it for me. I will catch you guys hopefully in Sumeru.